Smoothing the skin and airbrushing your photos has never been quicker with the new Lightroom Classic update. So today I'm going to be sharing with you how you can smooth the skin 10 times faster using the new Lightroom Classic. And I'm going to start right now. So before we get started and softening the skin within Lightroom Classic, we need to make sure that your Lightroom is up to date to actually do this effect. Make sure that your Lightroom is either Lightroom 2023 or Lightroom version 12.0. In today's tutorial, I'm actually using Lightroom 12.0.1, but as long as it's up to date, you should have this effect enabled. Anything older than this, it won't have this effect because we're going to be using AI masking. So let's go ahead and use this photo here as an example. It's a photo I took a while ago at a portrait shoot. Now all I've done is just a couple of changes within the basics panel. I haven't affected the softness of the skin in any way. What I can do is show you the before, so this is the original photo, and I'll show you the photo after. I've just done a few white balance changes and I've just done a few exposure changes. So let's go ahead and soften the skin within this photo. So let's go from our basics panel all the way over to the right hand side where you can see it says masking. Now the masking we want is the AI masking and this is absolutely amazing, revolutionary within Lightroom Classic and it's going to save so much time in post-production. So what we're going to do is go down to where you can see it says people and let's go ahead and select that. What it allows you to do is select different parts of the photo but automatically using Lightroom Classic's AI. As you can see you've got face skin, body skin, eyebrows, lips, teeth, hair, the list goes on and on. How amazing is this? So let's go ahead and click face skin and let's go ahead and create create mask. Now what we want to do is soften the skin. So let's go ahead and use one of Lightroom Classics presets. So instead of fiddling around with all of these, let's go to where you can see it says custom and let's go ahead down to this drop down. What we want to do is skip all the way down to where you can see it says soften skin. So we've got soften skin, but we've also got a slightly lighter version called soften skin light. Let's go ahead and just click soften skin for this example. And as you can see, wow, it has done a really, really good job. If I show you the before and I show you the after, it has created a really, to be honest, professional looking soft skin effect. What I can do is go back to our basics panel and let me show you the before and after. So the before is on the left hand side and the after is on the right. And if we go ahead and zoom in, as you can see, it is really softened that skin. But before you go ahead and use this effect, I'd recommend going into the spot healing brush tool found within Lightroom Classic and removing any larger spots and blemishes on the actual skin. It will create a smoother result overall. So here you go guys, here is the before, and here is the after. And if this particular effect worked for you, make sure to write it down in the comments below.